Hello everyone and welcome back to Autonauts. This is Otaku Showboat. And today is our... 15th? 16th? 16th, I think. Part uh, of the Autonauts series. Somewhere along those lines, I'm already losing track. I am... I can't believe I'm already losing track, so let's see. When I started recording these videos, it was episode 13. So 13, 14, 15, 16. This is, this should be 16. <laughs> oh boy. Now, if you've been enjoying this series thus far, please do not forget to comment, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to help make this series appear higher up in search results. You can do all of the social stuff through the links in the description below as per usual. Follows on Twitch and on Twitter. Uh, visiting my website, becoming a patron on Patreon at patreon.com slash Visiting my Discord and taking part in the community. Yeah, all those are fantastic things that you can do to uh, take part and do your part uh, for uh, the channel to help things grow and continue growing nicely. So, last time we left off, I was in the midst of working on cereal crops. That's what we were doing. We were working on uh, the beautiful cereal crops uh, right in here. Today, we need to find someone with shoes. Someone with shoes. Someone with shoes who can move quickly and you will be the cereal scyther. Scyther. Serial Scyther. However, we currently don't really have scythes. I are sad. Our Serial Scyther needs to pick up a scythe. And needs to come out here and do some scything. Do the scything. Move to Serial Crop and scythe. Now these have a yield of three. Uh, that's about as good as I want it to get. Use the item, give the thing, uh, and then from here you will do this until your hands are empty in the zone. Um, yeah, that zone is just fine. It works. Uh, when your hands are empty, you'll go grab more stuff, and you will do that forever. Now we need to have a, a thresher, a serial thresher. Your job is to grab a crude flail from storage. And you're gonna come down here with that flail and flail it. You're going to flail the cereal in the max area. Anything that may happen, you're going to flail it uh, until your hands are empty. Go down. Do that forever. Oh, and, uh... No, stop. Come to me, please. Uh, you... You're going to take this flail and go. Go do the thing. Who's the next one with shoes? You're the next one with shoes. You are going to be straw storage. Your job, if you so choose, is that you will find the nearest straw in the big L area and you will store it. That's your job. Do it well. Do it well, and do it often. That's all you need to do. I need a similar robot, also with shoes, ideally. Please, shoes, 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 shoes. Uh, I heard a ding, uh, so you're going to be the uh, cereal storage. Uh, excuse me, grain storage. You're going to... You're just going to go over here, pick up grain, and drop it off into grain storage to max area. 
Uh, until hands full. Until hands empty. Break if you can't find anything. And go and do that forever. And... You know, I heard a ding, but... That was not a uh, research ding, apparently. Uh, that's a lot of cereal. I think I might need another thresher. He must be getting another thingy. Another tool at this point. Must be going after another tool. I hope he comes back soon. Uh, buddy? Where's the buddy that will thrash the stuff? There it is. It's a common. So you can see, even with, uh... Even with something this small, this small little space right here, the robots are just fine. We're just fine. Alright, well that's... That's the consistent supply of straw, as well as technically of grain, uh, as time goes on. Uh... We've got the need now to make crude torches, a stick, and four straw. All right. Well, clearly we've had issues with robots that have tried to do more than one item at a time. Uh, so you are going to be torches straw. Uh, you're going to come over here uh times four take from straw storage down here and until hands are empty you know what not even times four just until hands are full you're gonna do that until they're full that until they're empty and you'll do all of that Forever! And then we'll have a robot, ideally also with shoes. I said ideally also with shoes, right there. Uh, you are going to be uh, torch sticks. Your job is you are going to pick up sticks from stick storage. And you are going to bring them down. I apparently have a stick storage right there, but anyway. Uh, you're going to grab it, and you're going to go down there. I heard a ding. That was not the tech. I just heard a random ding. Sure. Uh, you will do that until you're full that until you're empty. You're gonna do all that forever, and then I will have one additional robot with with the shoes. You are now torch storage. And your job is to exclusively find the nearest torch and store it in the crate. Don't ask me how that works. Uh with a fire in a wooden crate. Don't don't ask me how fire in a wooden crate works, but uh, it apparently works. Alrighty then. Oh, they're moving again. Good. About time. Now that the scythes are being made. What's next? Um. Good question. Uh, that I don't have an answer to. Wow, that's... They're doing their job. I have to say that with certainty. They're they're doing their job. I'm getting grain and the straws working and yeah, the my my colonists are all really happy. They love me very much. Uh it is time to do fresh water. All right. Where is fresh? This is fresh. Okay. So I can go and do... So, 
I have to decide. Do I want the long trip to be from here to a barrel somewhere over in this vicinity? Like, whose trip do I want to be short? Uh, I think either way, I'm screwed. So we're going to do this here. Yeah, I think either way, I'm just a screwed. Oh yeah, I never did do the poles and fixing pegs. Uh, I never did do the poles and fixing pegs. Hmm. To get the cranks. I never did cranks. I am realizing that these are going to make things, even with the stuff's full. Uh, they'll, they're going to be doing this forever. Um, yeah, you're going to stop, and I'm going to add... Uh, until that storage is full. Yeah. Where are you? Right there. So you're just going to stand until we use things. Okay. Uh, I need to do the same thing technically with uh, square frames. Someone making square frames. Uh, where I do have to do the check until this is full. Yeah, I do have to do that check until it's full. And this helps uh, a lot. This will help a lot with uh, with the production of stuff because it will stop these panels from being produced. Uh, that means I need to do the same thing with those. Yeah, I need to do the same thing with those uh, until this is full. Oh boy, bright lights. Very bright lights. That is a massive amount of bloom. That is a massive amount of bloom. Hey, tech. We can make crude fencing and good flooring. Yeah, planks and logs. Planks and logs. I like. I like, I like a lot. Yes. Yes, please. Very much, I like. Logs and planks on that good flooring. Now, I will note that much of this game has optional stuff, and a lot of that stuff that we've been unlocking is optional. Uh, I could... What do I need to do this upgrade? Stuff I don't have. Rough stone blocks uh, I don't have uh, at the moment. So let's see. Log cabins, crude pot upgrades. You need a torch. Well, gee, good thing I've started making torches. Give me the better cooking technology. Now, the better cooking technology is going to need the uh, kiln. Yeah, kiln. Kiln needs to exist. It needs five clay, apparently, to build the uh, kiln. Just five clay. Alright. Cool. Here, have a, uh, have a kiln. 
a killin'. I'll do this by hand myself. Have a killin'. Have a killin'. What does my killin' do? Makes clay pots. Raw. Makes clay pots out of raw clay pots. That's what it that's what it does. And then it needs fuel uh, in the form of logs. Okay. So I need to have a bot. Uh, because of the proximity to the logs, I'm not going to care so much. Uh, kiln fuel. You're going to pick up a log, bring it to the kiln. Yeah, find nearest kiln, add to kiln. Uh, yeah, forever. Just find nearest kiln, add to kiln. Add to killin! Add to the killin! So, we also need the crude clay station. Now this will be done out here. It will need square frames and panels, and this gives us the opportunity to uh, assign more blueprint bots. Uh, so you are going to be BP square frames. Yep, BP for square frames. Your job is to pick up square frames uh, until your hands are full. Uh, and then go and build. Find a blueprint and add to blueprint until your hands have been emptied. And that's all you need to do. That is all you need to do. Max that area out and play and, and do forever and play. We're going to do the same thing. You're going to be BP panels. You're going to grab a panel and add a panel. Remember that panels take up four hand slots at least. Lots of hand slots. So you'll be doing that forever as is in the area that I have designated to do blueprints. Uh, and you get to go and do the thing. Uh, I apparently have another chopping block set here. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Yeah, see, I did that. I did that for spades, didn't I? Um, who is here? Let's, uh, let's watch this no I did it here why are you still moving even after the spade is full oh because I guess I didn't do the check for you spades until until crude spade storage full Why are you only checking this now? Uh, hmm. All right. Sure. Oh yeah, they'll build the thingy here as well. Cool. Uh, I guess now I need to work on the cranks too. Yeah, so you will make raw pots I guess that's all you can do now. There's no other option for you. You make raw pots out of clay. You then take the raw pots and make clay pots. Uh, you need two units of clay to make a single raw pot. Uh, we will do this with individual robots uh, because of course we are. So this will be uh, pots raw. You're going to grab 
clay. Uh, you're going to do this until your hands are full. Uh, I'm not going to have you be the one that uh, ferries the items. We'll have someone else ferry the items. But here's the kicker. We're going to have to do this until A, storage is full, but I don't have that storage placed yet. We'll do it until this storage is full, and this storage is going to be for the pots. So you are going to be until... Until that storage is full. I said that storage is full. Yeah, it's still marked as question mark because it's a question mark storage. Uh, you'll do that forever. Uh, next doohickey with some shoes is you. You're going to be pots. Uh, you're uh, raw pots mover. Your job is that you are going to be picking up the clay pots and bringing them into the kiln. And that is all that you're going to do. You're going to do exclusively that forever. And then you are going to be a clay bowl storage. These are actually bowls, not pots, but eh. Eh. You're going to take the clay pot and you're going to store it. And that's all you're going to do. Forever and ever and ever. Uh... So yeah, I totally called that pots. Yeah, this is uh, bowels, B-O-W-E-L, bowel, raw, raw, bowel, bowel, mover. Uh, so yeah, that's clay pots. Enjoy. Clay pots. Lots and lots of clay pots. Uh. Bowel raw. Move to clay storage. Take the clay storage. Move to thing until hands empty. Oops. Until hands are empty, we need to do all these things. Yes, make the beautiful stuff. Make the beautiful things. All the beautiful stuff and things. We are now just about prepared uh, for this tech to uh, finish and get access to that stuff. Alright, what's like next? Next! Next! What's next? Uh, masonry? Wood shaping bench? I need to make the, uh, cranks. Oh yeah, that's, that's what we can do next. That's what we can do next, is the, uh, cranks. Yeah, cranks. Uh, let's see. Uh, who's got shoes? I need... Three with shoes. Three with shoes. Uh, you're going to be uh, cranks poles. Your job, if you choose to accept it, is to go here, fill your hands, head down here, empty said hands until this box has been filled. Go. Ding! Basic pottery is finished. Oh, I guess those dings represent uh, checklist completions uh, in the academy. We have unlocked the beret. Here's your pottery commemorative slab. Okay, cool. 
Very cool, indeed. Who's got... Shoes. Shoes! Uh, you are going to be the cranks. Uh, they're called rods. They're called rods. Cranks, rods. You're gonna go over here, you're gonna grab, uh, they're called pegs. They're called pegs. Uh, fixing pegs. You're gonna go down here and do that. You're going to do that until they're full. That until they're empty. And you'll do that forever. Uh, and you'll do that uh, until the thingy is full. You'll do that forever. Small holding cereal. Hey, we did the we did the stuff. We did the stuff. Uh, okay. Watering cans. Oh, okay. So this is how we're gonna be able to water our stuffs. Scarecrows. Uh, I guess that should scare off the chickens, right? Ideally. I ideally, right? Scarecrow. Uh, scarecrow. Can we, uh, can we make a scarecrow? What? Alright. I guess scarecrows are crafted in a thing. Apparently they're crafted in a, uh, workbench. A good workbench. Hey, what does this workbench have to say for itself? Uh, yeah, scarecrows and the watering cans. <laughs> hey, there's a reason to store your pumpkins! There's a reason to store your pumpkins. You can do scarecrows out of pumpkins. Straw and sticks, but it doesn't actually tell you what the scarecrow does, which I find interesting. Anyway, uh, let's do this. Find someone with shoes and be like, all right, pump. Pumpkin storage? Uh, you're going to have to try to find a pumpkin. In the area, please. <laughs> yes, in the zone. Find pumpkin, move to pumpkin, pick up pumpkin, move to crate, store the pumpkin, uh, if you can, uh, until your hands are empty, do, do the thing. Yeah, sure. Sure, just take pumpkins, we're, s we have a dude that hammers pumpkins, but, yeah, sure. Uh, I can tell that my tilling is the limiting factor here. I need additional tillers. I have five tillers. I want to throw that out there. It's likely just that I don't have enough production of... No, I have enough production of these. I've got the production of the tools, it seems. Hmm. Anyway... Uh, that is that. Okay, the cranks are being made. The cranks are being made, so now I need to have someone again with shoes. You are cranks storage. You're going to find the crank on the spot and place it next door. Uh, and do that forever. I don't care that you do only do it one at a time. Uh, it's only going to be making one at a time. Ah, fixing pegs, fixing pegs, fixing pegs. I need more fixing pegs. I need lots more fixing pegs. Uh, we've got five more-ish minutes. So what do I want to do in with these five more-ish minutes? Um... Should I make a Scarecrow? I don't think I need it, per se. 
for that spot anymore. But it's something I could do. Beautiful, beautiful pumpkin storage. I don't need any more than the one. I get the uh, certificate at 20. So, I... You are water collector. Uh, fresh water storage. That's what you are. You are fresh water storage. I need you to find a bucket. Where are my buckets? <laughs> uh, no, really. Where are my buckets? Right there. You are going to go grab a bucket. You are then going to go and collect fresh water. <laughs> find the nearest fresh water in. Yeah, I don't think you really need to do that. And then you're going to place it there, and you're going to do that until your hands are empty. Take the thing, do that forever. And there's beautiful fresh water. 400 units of fresh water can be stored. Interesting. I find you very interesting right now. That is cool. Now, something else that you can potentially do is you can have a robot, a, a series of robots attached to a sign that will find a bot in the area. Oh, I've stored 20. Find a bot in an area and give them an upgraded piece of equipment. So I can actually upgrade my Mark 1 bots up to or my Mark Zero bots up to Mark One if I so desired. Uh, piecemeal. I got the plumber's cap. Okay, sure. Sure, we we be Mario soon. We've already got the uh, overalls, so now we've got the uh, the the cap to go with it. Shall shall we be? Shall we be plumber? Shall we be the plumber? Because we've got the. Uh, Overalls and the hat. We be we be the plumber now. We be the plumber. Ah, uh, wouldn't it be cool? <laughs> wouldn't it be interesting if they also had the uh, the green, the green one for for Luigi, the other plumber, for other plumber? Yeah. I wonder if they have other plumber available. So. With that, I think I'm going to uh, quite possibly end this off here. Yes, I think I think we'll end it off here. What did we get done today? Uh, we've got uh, clay pots going today. That is, that is, I think our claim to fame today. Clay pots are moving today, uh, as are cranks, as are like lots of lots of things have been moving. I have a bot storage that can store robots now, potentially, up to 10. Really? Why would I ever only have 10? I... I... Place to permanently place bad robots, old robots, oldish bots. Uh, yeah, so our cereal's going, our clay is going, we've got Wonderful, beautiful things. Uh, just waiting on better cooking tech. Then we'll need to start thinking about working on clothes. Uh, that's going to involve uh, wool, most likely. Most likely that will involve wool. Uh, there's probably cotton somewhere. Oh, I need to... I need to explore more! Because I need to find our source of cotton and I need to start clearing an area or I guess we could do cotton like right here small spot for cotton and we can start working on uh, clothing we also need uh, could start working on like among all of these glorious things here 
start start working on the next level of shelter. See, this shelter has a rank of 2. We need a shelter with a rank of 3 to upgrade our colonists to 3, uh, as well as produce food at rank of 3, and give them shelter. So lots of, lots of things to do. And apparently we now have our cooking tech, which is going to give us access to beautiful things, and we can now upgrade our pots... Our pots can be upgraded. Clay, sticks, and torch. Clay, sticks, and torch. We will do this next time, folks. With that, I would like to thank you all for watching. This has been Otaku Showboat. And uh, if you have enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bells to help make this series appear higher up in search results. You can do all the social stuff through the links in the description below. Twitch, Twitter, website, Patreon, Discord. Uh, and I hope to see you all on the next one.